Since 2003, the focus for the month of November has been men's health. The goal of the Movember initiative is to change the face of men's health. And that's why many men choose to grow facial hair as a visible sign of support. The beards often become conversation starters and get men talking. I'm a, I'm a mo bro uh, th this month. Texas State Senator Kirk Watson isn't giving up on personal hygiene. He's sporting the stubble to bring awareness to cancer some men may be reluctant to talk about. I'm, I'm a testicular cancer survivor. I'm supposed to be dead a couple of times over. Doctors diagnosed Watson at age 32. After years of remission, a routine CAT scan found another tumor. I think it's, it's important for, for us to educate uh, young boys and men about men's health in a way that will make a difference for them. Not always do they know what they ought to be looking for or how to do self-exams. As a urologist, Dr. Lucas Giacomides understands that talking about cancer may be uncomfortable, but since one in six men will be diagnosed with prostate cancer in their lifetime, it's a conversation worth starting. It still kills over 30,000 men a year in this country. Um, and um, that despite some efforts to say it's not a killer, it's slow growing, if you live long enough, and nothing else claims you, this likely will. Prostate cancer occurs mainly in older men. Early on, there may be no specific warning signs or symptoms, so a prostate screening or a PSA blood test provides your best chance of early identification. As prostate cancer progresses, warning signs may include weak or frequent urination, the inability to urinate, pain or burning, blood in the urine or semen, and some men may experience nagging pain in their back hips or pelvis and have difficulty getting an erection. Dr. Giacomiti says complications from successful prostate cancer treatment can often be managed. Testicular cancer is largely a younger man's disease. Its warning signs include a lump in either testicle and a feeling of heaviness in the scrotum, a dull ache or pain in the abdomen, groin or testicle, a sudden collection of fluid in the scrotum and back pain. It's an unfair cancer because it hits men in their 20s uh, who have every reason to feel invincible. We feel great, we're at the peak of our virility, and then suddenly you feel a mass. Um, that type of uh, feeling should get your undivided attention. Go get checked in that day or the next day. You know, get seen, uh, because testicular cancer can double in size, double in size, within two weeks to up to eight weeks. There's no, there's no reason not to check yourself out, be, be aware, and then go to the doctor and ask questions. For RxWiki, I'm Rochelle Grossman.